been introduced to the concept of bank finance premiums, but you're just not sure how this accelerates growth. It really comes down to one simple principle, using other people's money. Let's suppose you know of an investment that comes with 5% guaranteed returns. You have $100,000. If you invest that $100,000, after a year, you'll have $105,000. Not bad, but not great either. But let's say that it costs you 3% to borrow money from a bank. You take the $100,000 that you already have, and you borrow $100,000 from the bank at 3%. You now have $200,000, and you invest all of it. After one year earning 5%, you have $210,000. You repay the bank the $100,000 principal and $3,000 in interest. That leaves you with $107,000, which represents $7,000 growth on your original $100,000 investment. You just earned 7%, even though the investment return was only 5%. Let's say instead of borrowing $100,000 from the bank, you were able to borrow $900,000. Between your money and the banks, you invest $1 million. After a year of 5% growth, you have $1,050,000. After repaying the bank the loan with interest, you have $123,000. Because you use the power of leveraging, you are able to earn 23% on a 5% investment return. These numbers get better the more bank money you use and the longer you leave the investment to grow. Now, you may wonder why more people aren't doing this. The answer is, they are. You probably are too, without even knowing it. Maybe you own your own home. If so, you probably financed it. Maybe you put $100,000 down on a $400,000 home. You would have financed $300,000 of the purchase price. If your home appreciates by 5% and your mortgage interest rate is 3%, you're experiencing leveraged growth based on interest rate arbitrage. Although it doesn't matter where your money is invested for this to work, the growth rate must exceed the cost of the leveraged money. If your investment is growing by 5%, you have to be able to borrow money for less than 5%. You're going to want to use something that has steady, predictable, and preferably guaranteed growth. That's why we use permanent life insurance. With the life insurance we use, there are guarantees built in as well as components of non-guaranteed growth. And because cash value life insurance is so safe, banks are willing to give loans with very low interest rates. Unlike traditional premium financing, our plans do not require a minimum net worth in the millions, do not require you to use personal assets as collateral, and do not require you to repay the bank's investment during your lifetime. The plan, which comes with a large death benefit, will pay the bank back when you die. Who says you can't have high returns on a safe investment? Conservative, safe investments don't have to mean low returns. Interested in seeing what your money paired with other people's money can do for you? Reach out today and we'll do a free analysis.